hi guys welcome to my channel this is Stella Stereo messages so I would like to thank each and every one of you for liking commenting subscribing and donating to my channel I really do appreciate all the love and all the support so we're gonna get started with our channel message today so I got the message before I started this reading that you have stirred somebody's interest okay you've piqued somebody's interest romantic interest but there is someone else that wants to sabotage this connection okay so you have I'm getting like you have a hidden enemy spirit what messages do you have for the collective what do you want the collective to know what messages do you have for the collective what do you want the collective to know spirit yeah so i'm really getting like you have a hidden enemy very close to home okay somebody that you will never suspect suspect yes suspect that is an enemy okay maybe this person stutters okay spirit what messages do you have for the collective what messages do you have for the collective Wow, we have the Ace of Pentacles, okay. We have the Four of Pentacles. We also have the Eight of Swords, feeling trapped. Okay, so you have a new offer coming in. Like I said, you stir somebody's interest, you pique somebody's love interest, okay. So somebody wants to ask you out, somebody wants to take you out on a date to get to know you on a deeper level, but somebody else is stressed out about that, okay? Somebody else is like intervening in the middle, okay? This person could be like very selfish, self-centered. Everything is about them, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? We have, wow, the King of Cups in reverse. Emotional manipulation. Somebody who is emotionally withdrawn, okay? Uh, emotionally unavailable. What messages do you have for the collective? We have the Wheel of Fortune. What messages do you have for the collective spirit? We have Six of Cups, okay? So somebody from your past who has been emotionally unavailable to you wants to return because the wheel of fortune is like destiny okay the wheel turning in your favor a new tide turning a new leaf and this is somebody from your past that wants to return while there is someone new coming in okay um i'm really getting it could be like a friend or somebody that you had like some sort of friends would benefit type of relationship okay i'm really getting like this is somebody that you cut off Maybe they were being a stalemate to you. We have the two of swords, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Yeah, you see, there's a new love coming in for you, okay? We have the two of cups, oh no, sorry, the two of pentacles, okay? Juggling, having multiple options or doing multiple things at once, and we have the strength card. So I feel like the person coming in towards you could be a Leo don't have to be but this person has a lot of integrity with the strength card this person is very generous they're very giving okay with the strength card they have a lot of inner strength okay this person does the right thing even if no one is looking but definitely there is a new love offer coming in for you there's someone okay so what i'm getting also the person from your past may know this new person they may not be close friends they may not be like acquaintances but there, i feel like there's like a six degree of separation where this person knows this new person coming in but they're not like they're not brethren okay like they're not friends i'm not getting that this is like your ex's friend or your ex friend friend's friend or something like that but they may know them through like so and so so like maybe like a cousin's friend or something like that or a friend's friend or a friend's friend's cousin like i said six degrees of separation that's how they may know this person okay but i don't feel like this new person is similar to this king of cups in reverse okay the person that's coming in for you is going to be stable who's going to be reliable okay trustworthy i'm getting they're going to very be very passionate, dedicated to you. 
Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? We have Four of Cups. Yeah, somebody from your past feels like it's a missed opportunity. And because they feel like it's a missed opportunity, they're trying to block this new person from coming in towards you. So by like gossiping about you, spreading lies, spreading rumors, so that way this person could lose interest in you, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Hey, you see all these cards that came out? That's what they wanna do, bring a lot of confusion, illusion, okay? They want to like basically tarnish your reputation so that way this person does not even look your way, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Yeah, you see? Ace of Swords. It's the truth, guys. Okay? And we have the Eight of Cups. Yeah, you see? They want this person to walk away from you, to emotionally withdraw from you, to lose interest in you, okay? We have this King of Cups. Now it's upright. So this person that's coming in, this person that you you pick their interest, this person is emotionally stable, emotionally reliable. They're very mature, okay? Very caring. They have a really a soft side to them, okay? Very nurturing nature. And we have the star. So maybe this person could be in the public eye with the star, or they could just be very popular. Maybe this is how your, like your ex person knows this new person, okay? And now this person has their eyes on you, this star, okay? This person could have Aquarius and Leo in their chart. So this person's very magnetic, okay? Everywhere they go, people stop and stare. They open doors for them, okay? Like this person is treated like royalty because this person carries themselves as such and they treat people with respect, okay? This is what I'm getting from this person. You see, wow, the Empress, okay? So this person, I'm getting like this new person that's coming in. Okay, that's that you pick their interest, sees you as the empress, whether you're male or female here, this person sees you as somebody who's abundant, who is beautiful, who's creative, okay, who has like high vibrational energy with the empress, okay, like you're a divine being. This is how this person feels about you. And this old person, this ex person, whether it's a friend, lover, um, ex-lover, family member, whoever it is, this person knows that you have like this Empress-like quality, that you are in the Empress energy. And because of this, because of the missed opportunity, they want to block you from receiving this new love, this new, it could like be friendship as well, like somebody who wants to see you do good, somebody who wants to add to you, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Yeah, we have two pentacles. You see two pentacles is here twice. So this person wants you to be juggled, okay? For you to always be in like, you know, a one-sided relationship where you're always like um, a second option, okay? Spirit, wow, you see this person wants you to experience a ten of swords because that's the ten of swords that's just flipped over. This person wants you to experience ten of swords. That's what they want, okay? A painful ending for you. They want this um, connection to um, end abruptly, okay, without warning, just caught off, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? Yeah, you see, this person wants you to be ghosted with the hermit card, okay, to be left alone so that way you... You feel like you're unlucky when it comes to love. You feel defeated when it comes to love, like nobody else is going to love you or you're never going to find someone better. Okay, so this person is trying to discourage this new person from coming in and they're trying to make you lose hope in love. This is this person's intention. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? We have malady, you see? This person wants you to be, you know, sick, okay? Feel like not feeling well, losing your self-esteem, okay? Feeling down, that's what they want for you, okay? Yeah, we have messenger. That's like I said, this person is spreading lies and gossip about you to the new person that's like interested in getting to know you, okay? Spirit, what can you tell us about this new person? You see, wedding, okay? This person sees you as marriage material. They're talking about you, conversation, like I said. And then now we have old lady. 
so this person could be older than you i'm really getting like a female energy okay somebody who's spreading lies and gossip about you a jealous woman or a jealous man okay it doesn't have to be a woman but this person is very bitter maybe because they lost their chance of being with somebody okay or maybe they like got they were married and they failed like the marriage failed and now they're seeing this new person maybe this like i'm getting like maybe this new person talks about you to this old lady and this old lady is like spreading lies gossip about you so that way this person lose interest in you but i feel like you're the new person that's coming in they are still interested in you they don't really care what they hear they want to see for themselves okay this is like a truth seeker okay this person that's coming in they don't really take people's opinion in face value okay so just one second guys spirit what messages do you have for the collective Wow, we see sorrow. This person, you see this old lady wants you to be in sorrow, okay? It could be an older man, but I'm getting this person from your past, okay? If it's, like I said, an ex, a friend, family member, this person wants you to be in sorrow. They want you to be in heartbreak, okay? Spirit, what messages do you have? Yeah, you see constancy. They're like constantly bad-mouthing you, okay, talking. Guys, I can't make it up. Enemy and thief, okay? enemy and right under the old lady and thief thief of joy this person is trying to steal what is yours okay because i feel like this person that's coming in is genuinely interested in you genuinely trying to get to know you okay but i feel like this person is asking you around to just make sure that you know that you don't have anything that could come off as a surprise to this person they want to make sure that you have integrity just like them so they're just doing their due diligence to make sure that they're stepping into like a situation that is going to be conducive to what they're trying to do what they're trying to build because this person is trying to get married this person wants something serious and stable okay and like i said they could be in the public eye or just maybe popular in their environment or in their community and this person sees you as the empress so a divine feminine divine masculine okay and they're just trying to make sure that like i said stepping into something that's conducive to them okay and you see this person's an enemy constantly talking ish about you with conversation okay spreading lies and gossip they're trying to steal something from you and they're trying to block this connection to come to fruition that's what they're trying to do spirit what messages do you have for the collective what messages do you have for the collective see wife this person this new person is trying to make you their wife or their husband or they want to i'm really getting like more masculine energy but also okay if there's masculine watching here is the same thing okay this person wants to be your wife okay but there's an old lady or older man that is, you know, spreading lies, gossip about you to make this person not come towards you. Okay. Yeah. You see, so that way this person does not journey towards you. Okay. This is the fool here. They don't want this person to come towards you. And the wife is like similar to the empress. Okay. Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective? What do we have here? Wow, you see faithfulness and frivolity. And frivolity is like lightness, okay? Something light, uh, breezy. And faithfulness, okay, like a dog, loyal, okay? This person that's coming in is loyal, while this other person is like light, you know, flaky, okay? In and out, wishy-washy, okay? That's what they want for you. They want this person, basically what I'm getting is like, they want this person to lose faith in you, okay? And also to be um, wishy-washy, in and out, like indecisive towards you. So that way they like they lose their interest. You see, love at the bottom of the deck. This person, this new person is coming in with love. They want to be in a connection with you okay they want to take it to the next level but at first they want to get to know you all right 
so that's all i have for you guys so i hope this reading resonated if it did please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i hope to see you in my next video bye